Yamamoto makes his 10th start as a Dodger, faced these Diamondbacks a few weeks ago, and fired six scoreless innings. He was very good in that outing, and that's got to make him feel good going in when you start to face other teams for a second time. The unanimous rookie of the year, franchise changing player, really, has fallen off a cliff this year. Chase is here, a disappearing splitter for the first out. Last outing against Arizona was in Arizona. Here he's got some sea level air to make the breaking stuff even break better. Here is Cattell Marte. That extended his hitting streak. It's now at 18 consecutive games and make it 19 as he drops it into shallow center. Cattell Marte has hit safely in 19 straight games. Yamamoto's 0-2 pitch, swing and a miss, strike three. Splitter that dropped off the table. Yamamoto trying to strand Cattell Marte on first base. He's a strike away from doing so. He's set to fire a 2-2. It's on the way, and Walker checks swing, but he does go around. So three Ks for Yoshinobu Yamamoto. One hit, no runs. We'll go to the bottom of the first. Mookie Betts, Shohei Otani, and Freddie Freeman. So the Diamondbacks are going to throw a little bit of a different look here against the Dodgers to start the top of the first inning. It is the left-hander, Joe Manaply, who is expected to turn in a scoreless first inning and really set the table for the young right-hander, Slade Ciccone, who will take a bulk of this ballgame. Grants punches it to left. Lourdes Gurriel Jr. makes a sliding grab. Well, Lourdes' defense out there continues to impress. Another day where Shohei's in the headlines with his first walk-off hit as a Dodger yesterday. And here he squares, lays down a bunt. Manaply grabs it and throws wide off Walker's glove. The throw took him into the path of this monstrous man, and Walker couldn't catch it. Freddie Freeman in there. Ground ball to Suarez at third. Newman for one. And they roll it. Antiply gets the double play ball. Job well done. Dave Roberts said he got tired of being mediocre. And when you hear that, it's like, oh, you know, you, what, you a couple bad months, and then he put his foot down. No, it was like two bad starts. So then Dave said it was like he flipped a switch, and he said being new isn't an excuse. And now the right-handed third baseman, Eugenio Suarez. Woo! Execute he does. First a two-seamer to get a swing and a miss, and then that splitter finishes off a 10-pitch set. And here is the right-hander, Slade Ciccone. This technically is not a start. It will feel like one for him. He had made five previous this year and had a 1-3 record with a 5-2-7 ERA. 2-2. Swing and a fly ball hit out towards right. It is playable for McCarthy. And no problem there. He makes the catch. The rookie has had trouble getting deep into starts. Really dominated lineups the first time through. Opponents are 1-43. for 43. The first time through. One for 43 with 13 strikeouts. It's a bullet up the middle. Into center field. A one out base hit for tail. Go to first. Got, Got him. him. Oh. They pick off to Oscar Hernandez. Ryan Wills made the call at first after Pa has swung through that heater from Ciccone. For it being that close, Tasker is very casual getting in there. Yeah, Danny Lehman says let's go ahead and challenge it. Made it pretty easy. It looks like, yeah, the impact of the glove is after the impact of the base with the foot. After review, the ball in the field is overturned. The runner is safe. Los Angeles retains their challenge. Pajes, who homered yesterday to start the scoring for the Dodgers. Boy, Slade stepped on the gas, got another fastball by Pajes, and that's his first strikeout. Good location for it, too. We've talked a lot about this recently, that high fastball. As now the pitch swung on, jam shot flare, and rushing out is the third baseman, Suarez, to make the over-the-shoulder catch. And that'll do it for the Dodgers. Ground ball to second. Diving pick Miguel Rojas for the first down. Sparkling play. Sparkling player no matter where you put him. Here comes the 1-2 pitch. Swing and a ball absolutely laced. Down the left field line and into the corner it rolls. Newman rounding first. And he is into second base. And the nine hitter worked in at bat did Marte. He's aboard for the second time. Playing with fire there. Yeah, you really are a guy who has 75 home runs in this ballpark. About to see the eighth pitch from Yamamoto. Peterson knocks it into center. They're going to wave Newman. Here's the throw from Paez. It's a little offline, and he's in there safe. Jack Peterson, the former Dodger, makes it 1 0 Diamondbacks. What an at bat. What an at bat. Boy, and he hit a bullet back up the middle of the field right there. 
Kike Hernandez, just four hits in 12 games so far this month. He has walked seven times, though. Kike trying to lead this inning off the right way. Hits it hard, center field. Carroll pushed back. He will look up and watch it fly. Kike Hernandez with a laser to straightaway center field. Leads off the third inning with his third home run of the season. Giddy up, folks. Freddie Freeman, bags packed full of teammates and no outs in the inning. Tough call. Freddie 0 for 1. Flag drive, deep center field. Freddie Freeman, grand slam! Out of the saddles and in front five to one. He's not just getting high fives, he's getting high tens. Home run number five. Four ribbies added to his total. Three more added to the scoreboard. It's 4-1 Dodgers. Will Smith behind 0-2. Is anybody that can produce in this spot, it's him. Another 1-2. Will Smith puts a charge into one. This one deep to left, and this one is gone. It's a home run derby for the Dodgers in this third inning. I told you, don't worry. Be happy. Put another one up there. Let's do the math slow this time. Five plus one, six, one Dodgers. Back to the bump for Yoshinobu Yamamoto. Right-hander now four and one on the year. Swing and a miss. Looping curveball to finish off Carroll on three pitches. He swings at the first pitch. Puts one in the air to left field. Pushing Teoscar Hernandez just in front of the warning track. Here comes the 2-2. Two -two. Sticks with the fastball and goes up a notch on the ladder to finish off Jack Peterson. And the sixth strikeout for Yamamoto ends the fifth inning. With Yoshinobu Yamamoto done with his preparations for the top of the sixth inning. He will face Christian Walker, Lourdes Gurriel, and Jake McCarthy, four, five, and six. Big swing and another miss. That's punch out number seven for Yamamoto. Ground ball to Kike Hernandez. Just inside the line at third and fair. He throws it across to Freddie Freeman. Two down. Jake McCarthy off of the hands to first and Freeman to Yamamoto. That is a seven pitch inning. And the Dodgers have a 6-1 lead as we go to the bottom of the six. Suarez to lead off. Suarez belts one to left field. That gets down for extra bases. It's off the wall. Taylor plays it. And Suarez is in standing up. Gino will lead off double. That's a start. Good to see Gino squaring something up. Hit that ball down into the left field corner. One on nobody out in the seventh. Dodgers leading six to one. And that should be strike three. It is called strike three. Number eight for Yoshinobu Yamamoto. Mark Abbey looking. Here's Newman who's two for two. He has single, doubled, and scored their only run. And he's got another hit. That's off the glove of Rojas. Here comes Suarez. The throw is just a little late. Gino sneaks in there. The RBI for Newman is three for three. And it's a six to two ball game. Gets deep into a game. Six and a third from Yoshinobu Yamamoto and leaves to another good hand. And hands it off to Anthony Banda, who makes two appearances in his first two days with the team. So second and third. Really need a base hit right here. And with a left-hander out there and Jock Peterson coming up, Randall Gritchick is coming off the bench. Banda needs one more strike to finish the seventh. His 1-2 to Gritchick. Little cue shot right back to Banda, who fields it calmly and throws to first. It's a low throw, but it's picked by Freddie Freeman before Gritchick can touch the bag. So two stranded by Banda. It's only one run for Arizona in the seventh inning. Let's hear his Guriel. He has put the ball on the ground three times tonight. And this is a good start. Guriel in the air down the line, and Lourdes Guriel Jr. sends one out of here. That's his first home run since April 16th, and it's 6-3. to three. All right, you needed something. Well, with one out right now, just another base runner. Only a three-run game. 2-2, two -two, that's hit well. Deep to right field. Back to back go the Diamondbacks on McCarthy's second of the season. Well, they're not done yet. McCarthy really turned on that one. Long gone into the bullpen. Bases loaded with Dodgers. One out in the eighth inning. They're up by two. Would love to lead by more. The 3-2. It's grounded to third, Suarez gloves to second for one, throw to first in time. That's your double play, and the inning is over. The Dodgers do not score. The dangerous Cattell Marte, the dangerous and hot Cattell Marte on deck. The payoff. Got him with the fastball. Two gone in the ninth. And a strike away from finishing the job. Hudson's 2-2 pitch. Sits him down. 
and ends the ball game. One, two, three, ninth inning for Daniel Hudson to finish off a fourth consecutive win for the Dodgers. Congratulations, Yamamoto. That was a fantastic outing for him to set this victory up. The bullpen finishes it off. He's now 5-1 and one with a 3-1-7.